first experience of understanding uh, um, what my what my family was about was seeing my grandfather's uh, face on a calendar. We had this calendar when I was very young. Uh, I think this was the 81, 82 edition. But I was a very, I was a little boy, and the. Uh, and, and it was a calendar that had all of the Rivonia trialist on it. Oh, I grew up in a community of heroes. So it was cool, but it was the norm because everybody was a freedom fighter in, in, in my early life. You know what made the freedom fighters and their kids' lives great? It was a cause. They had something, they had this dream, they had this fire. You know, they had this vision of something great that could happen and was going to happen. It wasn't even a question of if or when or how. It was, yeah, it wasn't even a question of if. It was definitive. It was going to happen. That I suppose the pathology that's been passed down to me is the pathology of cause. Mm. This is the cause. This is what we're doing this for. We're not doing this for, you know, just J for kicks and for, you know, for giggles, but there's a cause. And it's a definitive cause. It's a just cause. It's a cause that that you can um, that you can defend. We're all very important, but we're all very important because we have to go and save, uh, you know, safeguard the the you know have to go and protect even more important people. So that's how I grew up. I never grew up with this 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 phenomenon. This celebrity phenomenon is a now thing, you know, where people people are important in jail because of where they were born or. Who they know, or the, I don't know, crap with that thing. Um, the idea for me that this guy, Gandhi, can say, I'm going to change my country simply by the things I do. So if my country, my God, my country is in flames, oh my goodness, what am I going to do? I'm going to go fast. It's so counterintuitive. But that's it. If you want to change the world, you have to start with yourself. So, you know, being able to get to a point where you just are not hamstrung by the little crutches that we pick up in life. That, that, that's the becoming I most relish. That's the book I want to write about.